hello my pretties coming to elaborate on the last read um let's take a deeper look okay so in the last read we have explored the fact that you are stepping into a new chapter your ex it feels like this is definitely an ex very mad okay very upset they have you know for a lot of you guys sent the energy of death at you okay or death to your finances de death to your love life everything <clears throat> okay just sending the energy of death for some of you guys they have actually signed a contract with your name on it i believe the contract is spiritual they have signed a contract um selling their own souls okay um when you guys let me just say this real quick when you guys um start to wonder and i've told you this before when you start to wonder why someone would do something like that to you Hold on, let me say this energy. When you guys start to wonder why somebody would do something like that to you, you have to take into account that they have um, sold their own souls, okay? Um, some of these karmics even sell the souls of their own children, okay? And so when you go to think why would they do something like that to you in particular, they don't care, okay? They do not care. We had um, this energy come up in the last three, two inner childhood wounds. This person is very mad. They don't want to take accountability, accountability for nothing that has transpired in their life. And with those inner childhood wounds, it has started from since they were a child. So some of the things that they have experienced, it's actually not their fault. Now, the monster that they turned into um, instead of healing is where the fault comes in. Using people is where the fault comes in. But again, like I said, these people are selling their own souls and the souls of their children. So why would you think that you were exempt? Okay. I mean, in retrospect, because they always show you a different face in the beginning. That's what a narcissist does. Okay. This person is suffering from an entity attachment, but this entity attachment is an, an attachment that they brought on on themselves. So no matter what this person comes in and tell you, remember that they're a shape shifter. It does not matter. Okay. They're just looking to get in. They're looking to transfer this energy. So what happened was they're telling me like they sent the energy of death your way. It was reflected back to them. So now they're scrambling. They ha they're having anxiety. For some of them, um, I heard that they are actually fearing their own death, okay? Or death or the death of things around them things that are connected to them their love life their their money especially this person is very focused on their money okay very focused on their money so what they're doing is they're trying to devise a plan um to come back into your life a lot of them are using love spells trying to devise a plan to come back into your life so they can then get, give you the karma that they are receiving for what they did to you ain't that some shit okay so again, we're going deeper into this because some of you guys really need to be careful and be aware. This person is um, having sex for money and they're also doing it spiritually. I'm going to break that down in another read as well. Okay, if you're seeing this person in your dreams a lot, they may be trying to have astral sex with you. They're also doing it to others because that's what they signed up for. Okay, so it's not only astral prostitution that they're doing. They are actually prostituting on the 3D as well. I'm going to do a read on astral prostitution. I done wrote that shit down weeks ago to tell y'all about it and I, I haven't. Okay, but I'm going to get to it. All right. Um, and start breaking down these things that go on. The reason why they would be doing such is because because of the contract that they signed, they have to go around and collect energy. Okay, whether it be spiritually, you know, like I said, in the astral or on the 3D, because they need to funnel all this energy back to Stephen, him downstairs, the devil or whatever entity that they made this pact or deal with. Okay. Now, with this energy of I wish I was you that came up um, in the last read, I'm going to tell you right now, these, a lot of these men and, and, you know, it could be women flip the situation. All right. 80% of women watch my channel. I know because I looked at the analytics. All right. 80% of women watch my channel. So that's why, you know, um, I'm speaking to that, that, you know, majority. Right. But this person, I mean, these men, what happens is they're so used to vamping on our energy that they get confused, okay? This person sees you having, you know, blessings coming your way after all the things that were done to you. You may even have your own inner childhood wounds. So this person is looking like the way you have grown, the way you have persevered, the way you're so resil resilient. I've even done things to you and you've bounced back. I wish I was you. 
you receiving your blessings. You kept your faith in God. I wish I was you. I wish I could be that. A lot of these men that are, you know, misogynistic, okay, they do have issues with their mom. And again, like I said, they're so used to vamping on our energy that they want to be us. And that's where it gets real weird, <laughs> okay? for lack of a better word. And that's where it gets real weird. A lot of these men have these female entities that are um, on their backs, okay? Because I told y'all what Stephen be doing. He'll put the female entities in the males and he'll put the male entity entities in the females. And so they be having like identity crises, crises uh, or something, all right? They'll have, uh, you know, urges and things to be with the same sex. And that's just what come with the territory. So let's see what's going on in this person's life. So we have mother. I told y'all this person have issues, has issues with their own mother, okay? Or female energies in their life. And I feel like this started from since they were a child. What did I say? Birth, okay? This somebody, this person may have gotten someone pregnant. Comparisons are easily done once you've had a taste of perfection. He's saying, he says, this, this energy says comparisons are easily done once you've had a taste of perfection. Meaning like I have, I'll I, I be, I be thotting and bopping and I never found a chick like you before. Never. And I'm always comparing because I've already had a taste of, of perfection, okay? Now this person is looking at you as perfection, but don't be flattered by that because at the end of the day, it's not like they want to be, only want to be with you. They want to be you as well. And that's, and that's where the threat comes in. It's like jealousy behind this. I don't want nobody looking at me like I'm perfection. Because what's wrong with you? Ain't nobody perfect. That tells me where your mindset is. Right, right then and there. This person is being led with the sage energy here. This person could be a Sagittarius, or you could be a Sagittarius. Like I said, this person could have uh, found themselves in a situation where they're running away from a child that they just had. I feel like they're. Uh, inquiring about what's going on in your life and we picked that up in the last three they want to know what's going on in your life yeah they want to get to the money anybody that they see thriving especially women okay that they see thriving it's like this person goes in and go leech off them <laughs> okay they're far off from it though is what it feel like they're far off from where the money is this person is having issues issues um with uh this person is having issues with finances serious issues yeah this person like walked away from their responsibilities the responsibilities of some sort of child some sort of child you know what i mean okay responsibilities of uh the birth of a child they're running from that. They're, again, here go this four of pentacles energy. They keep describing this person as that, even in the last read, it's like, this person want to hold on to their money. So they're going to run away from their responsibilities, especially if they if they just had, I just heard secret pregnancy. I don't know why this pregnancy was a secret, okay? Um, you know, I don't understand how people hide whole babies. That shit always blows my mind. Like, like why are you hiding a, a, a life? There's no, I just heard like this person doesn't, there's no future with this person. There's no future. I feel like their collaborations have gone sour. If they're trying to pretend like they can offer you something, you know, like I said, it, it's just, they're just pretending. Yeah. They trying to, and I feel like this person is constantly thinking about the past as well. Or wanting you to think about the past. 
because because it, it then it will open you up to inviting them back into your life. Yeah, with this kindred partnership. They want you to feel like you're missing something um, without being with them. They want you to feel like they um, have changed. They want you, like I said, to allow you back into, allow them back into your life. It feels like they're leaving someone. They're the them the them their secret baby mama or something like that. It's like, yeah, uh, I see, I see divine feminine over here thriving. Uh, catch you later. Bye kids. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, that's crazy. This person go, I just heard Papa was a rolling stone. Wherever he laid his hat was his home. This person is involving themselves with, um, wickedness. Okay. A walking negative entity okay a negative entity has settled in their vessel and it's very comfortable tetris may be of significance uh, tetris may be a confirmation for somebody yeah they're moving towards you like I said, this person is trying to get to the money. That's why they're moving towards you, okay? And they, and I feel like they're coming in strong. It's because, and, 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 and the strength behind them is their ego. I got to have it. I got to get to the money. I got one pentacle. We picked up in the last week. This person only got one pentacle, okay? And they're trying to invest it wisely, and you are where they want to invest it. Because then they're going to be able to carry out all their wicked plans, I don't, okay, so some of you guys may have been pregnant by this person or may even be currently pregnant by this person or something like that. And they say, like, I feel like this person wasn't taking care of their responsibilities or something, or you may have a child with them. And it's like, they're going to come and try to like, oh, I know I haven't been doing, you know, what I'm supposed to, but here go a dime for the baby. Don't, don't, don't be quick to be like, oh my God, finally, I can take this diamond. <laughs> Buy her a piece of candy, finally. Like, no, okay? Yeah, because this person is coming to you with a consciousness of lack. They cannot help you. They're looking for you to help them. And they're looking to steal your light from you, okay? Remember, we picked up, I wish I was you. person can't do nothing for you but make you sick and bring you home okay and leech off of you this person is dating <clears throat> they're dating somebody okay i feel like they date a lot of bodies <laughs> okay date okay sleeping with okay with this holes in this house energy they they're, they're telling me that this person receives a lot of affection okay this 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 individual might be good looking or they might present themselves as you know clean cut or whatever the case is all right i do feel like there's some sort of energy about this person that brings on um that brings the brings the boys to the yard or brings the girls to the yard and that's probably that succubus incubus entity that they got riding their back <laughs> okay Wow. They just said that for some of you guys, the way how one of the times that this person mask came off is during sex. So they might have been using some sort of glamour spell or some uh, using some sort of, you know, like I said, with that entity on your back, you don't even need to you, you don't even need to use no type of spell. They'll do that. You are a walking spell when you carry a, a negative entity on your back. OK, so I, it feels like their mask may have come off. You have may have heard them make a demonic noise while they're having sex or, you know, um, saw a demon while you was having sex with them or something like that. 
while, especially when um when there's a climax, okay? Because that's one of the one of the um one of the times where you lose all control. So you might have saw this person shape shift while they climax. Child. This person has an issue with closure with you. They feel like it ain't it ain't it ain't over. Okay, they keep replaying old 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 thoughts in their mind about you. They feel like it's not over. And 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 a part of it, like I said, is because they want to be with you. But the other part of it is like, I didn't get to ruin your life properly. Give me another chance. <laughs> Give me another chance. Okay. is downloaded into them yeah it get it it, it it with that king of swords energy it gives them it gives them power it 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 lets them um it tells them what the plans are how to move okay with the with the hierophant in reverse this is a demonic entity that is connected to um a group okay yeah very very this person's heart chakra is closed okay and um okay so they're saying what is prominent about this person is their ego okay their heart has been replaced with ego they're not operating out of their uh heart chakra they're operating out of their solar plexus in their sacral which uh in their root, okay? Lower chakras, which is where these, you know, where this entity is attached. That tells you that this person is not genuine at all. Heart chakra closed. Probably been closed since they were since they were a kid. Whatever traumatic, whatever traumatic events that transpired in this person's life, I feel like that's where they lost their heart. You probably the only thing that make this person feel like home. Comparisons are easily done. Wish you had a taste of. This person is saying like, don't nobody make me feel like you do. But that's just that's just because you know divine feminine your energy is or divine masculine your energy is intoxicating. They drunk. They get drunk off your energy. They feel healed off your energy. They get power off of your energy. All these things, okay? But they just like a tick. Like they just, they're just going to suck you dry. They have to. Because how else will they stay alive? This person is scrambling for energy right now. Yeah. Whoever this person is, they may be an Aquarius, but their mother broke their heart. Here we, uh, we, we, here we go again. Their mother broke their heart. This all ties back, yeah, with the with the tower energy. Their mother broke their heart. That didn't have nothing to do with you. There's something here about signing a birth certificate, all right? I don't know what that's about, but I hope that helped y'all. <laughs>